Hello, YouTubers and all those who happen to watch. Oh man, touch my nipples. Anyway, I hope you guys are ready because four shoutouts will be coming your way right now. So, okay, the first gentleman I want to talk about is Soft Utaku. Now, this gentleman is currently is an American residing in Japan, very similar to Luke Morris one. And uh, this guy, of course, does a lot of pickups, goes the hard off, etc., etc. I mean, he's just overall pretty straightforward guy he has this sort of awkwardness to him that is very charming in a very heterosexual manner he'd be homosexual i don't know at this point because it's just he turns me on every single time he turns that camera on I, <laughs> sorry a little bit of humor there so what does he offer to the table well like i said before he visits hard off he shows the sides of japan now it sounds very similar to luke morris one but hey if something's good and entertaining, why not come from multiple sources, right? So, I mean, he shares, you know, his experiences of Japan. Luke shares his experiences of Japan. I think it's awesome because, quite frankly, I don't think I'm ever going to visit Japan anytime soon. It isn't that I hate the country. It's just because, you know, I'm broke. So, it's just awesome to see these cool and crazy wacky things that can be distributed from Japan, such as, like, soft drinks and, you know, beers and gadgets and consoles and stuff everywhere it's awesome nonetheless so definitely check out soft utaku now the next gentleman here is lmn234 which is my friend justin uh me and him talk on a daily basis on ventrilo and you know through pms if possible and uh basically what does he offer well here's the thing he's a very talented guy i he just is very smart very talented very humble to his friends kind of guy and well while i understand he's busy at the moment i still think that he has content archived on his channel that is at least worth checking out and again not to put him on the spot but i think that he is a fantastic uh, you know, when it comes to content he just likes to put out whatever he wants and just does it when he wants kind of thing which is admirable to a degree it's it, it's just a nice thing to sit back and look at his older videos and go ah oh, that's cool yeah, that's cool you know him just sort of lightly brisking on a couple games here and there but again, check him out. One of the boys, just like Soft Utaku. Uh, moving on, this is actually a step away from, you know, gaming. So if you're into movies, DVDs, and reviews for movies, uh, this gentleman will be steering you no wrong. Now, this gentleman, of course, is called Real Screen Reviews. His name is Nick. And uh, basically what he offers is he watches movies every two to three times a week, goes to the actual theaters, pays for the admission, goes and watches these movies, and tells you the reviews on YouTube and lets you know if they're worth watching or not. And I, of course... Have have, you know watched a couple of his reviews and compared it with my own opinion and i gotta say you know most of the time i agree with him most of the stuff so it's usually very interesting to see how insightful he is towards certain movies and he writes down everything he thinks of the movie so he puts a lot of work into his reviews and it's just really awesome they could put like a short summed up uh thesis of what he thinks of it and B course puts credibility behind the review. So you feel like you can actually relate to him because he kind of, he kind of sounds like he's talking to you in a professional manner. At the same time, he's kind of talking to you in a, uh, in a very, you know, very laid back. You're hanging out with him. It's kind of like you asked him personally. So what'd you think of this movie? And he, it kind of sounds like he's, you know, metaphorically telling you and it's just really wild so definitely check out real screen reviews and the last gentleman here i think really deserves a lot of attention is of course immortal 119 now what does he offer again he's like one of the boys i like the list i just mentioned and what he offers is you know he's a very humble youtuber he does content daily he uploads videos that games he's find interesting and wants to share with everybody i mean that's the important thing i think with youtube especially with a game community is that you share video games uh most of these guys so far i've mentioned are just doing their thing which is just really fantastic and awesome so again what he does is he offers again random assortments of games just like myself and a few others here on youtube so far I've accumulated a conversation piece with here and there and that of course concludes this video but uh closing out though i want to say a couple extra things for immortal 119 before i do that so that way i can give him you know more than just a couple words and uh, i gotta say he you know he does respond to his video clips daily so if you do pm him or send him a message on his uh, video saying oh nice video you know he does usually respond back quickly and you guys notice that most of these viewers or most of these accounts here have a fair amount of review uh, i'm sorry subscribers my bad and you know quite frankly i look at it like this with these guys i just mentioned they have a lot of credibility. They're really down to earth, really awesome guys. And I think they deserve a couple extra subscribers. And that's pretty much the summary of this video. Now, of course, I do have a huge list of uh, subscriptions I do go through daily and try to watch when I can. 
because it's a lot big list so you know you have to sort through it and you know take your dose daily <laughs> again if i come across any more guys which i most likely will soon because i have an extra list here and there probably i will be able to tell you guys these guys very soon and girls i'm not i'm gonna say guys and girls rather of these people that i can point out in the future so again take it easy folks thank you guys so much for watching and take care and make sure to rub your nipples daily oh man dr dan van dam signing out